Tick up it up. For, huh? Come on, let's do this. I didn't need the help. I was always better at this part than you. Yeah, the killing part? The day's gonna come, little brother. I won't always be there to help you. Don't worry, though. You're the same as me. You just don't know it yet. What don't I know? The tale of why the moon is lonely. No, why don't you enlighten me? The moon had a lover, Kwekuachu. But Trickster wanted the moon for himself, so he suggested Kwekuachu come to our world and pick her some wild roses. Never trust a guy named Trickster. Kwekuachu found out that once you leave the spirit world, you cannot return. So now he's trapped here, doomed to howl at the moon forever. Kukukachu got screwed. Kwekuachu, the Wolverine. Kayla, run. Don't ask why, just run. But Logan... Go! You. Hey, little brother. Long time no see.
old lady get to. Please, Kayla, stay with me. You're okay. You're okay. No, Logan, she isn't. Striker. I came to warn you! You knew he was coming? Victor's appetites were becoming too public. We had to confine him. He felt betrayed, went AWOL, said he's coming for all of us. So you didn't come to warn me, you came to save your own ass. He killed Wade. You were supposed to be next. <laughs> What's your plan, Captain? I'm gonna find him and kill him. You already tried. You can't beat him, Logan. You know you can't. But there is another option. I can give you the tools to defeat him. I can promise you two things. You will suffer more pain than any other man could endure. Your bones will be coated in adamantium. When we're done, you'll be able to withstand anything. Even Creed. Where did you fight him, my best box? It's more important to me than his life. Don't even think about what the hell. Stand down, Captain. My brother, my responsibility. At my command. The operation was a success, but he can't be trusted. We have his DNA for Weapon 11. Terminate him. Science 
word. You won't be harmed. The facility is in a concrete log, Captain William Stryker. Our top scientific minds would have us believe that the appearance of Homo Superior is little more than an aberration. But what if they're wrong? What if the number of mutants continues to increase? And what if they become even more powerful? To the point where they determine we're no longer necessary. The incident with the team in Africa has shown me that mutants are incapable of being trusted. We humans must take steps to protect ourselves. He's in. while you were in the adamantium tank. I can help you, but first you have to come to my lab. I'll unlock a door for you. Yeah. And be careful. They've sent ghost squads. 